Richard, the first thing I'd like to do is thank you so much for coming here and sharing your knowledge and your time with everyone at Sail Oklahoma. When I started reading and became aware of the trimarans and catamarans and the multi-hull boats, and I, I don't know anything about them, but I was following them, and I kept seeing people building your boats. People I knew that were home builders were building your boats. And that was something that fascinated me, that people could build these home-built multi-hulls. You've been in this a long time. Uh, what got you to start designing boats, and in particular, the multi-hulls? Well, my first, when I was five years old, my dad built me my first boat, which was a sailing catamaran, and he built it out of one gallon uh, oil cans and some bits of two before and I sailed that and I've even got some pictures of me sailing it so that was always that was the start I started in 1959 sailing a catamaran um, and then we started going on and sailing uh, dinghies and little pocket cruisers we had one of the very first West White Potters ever built um, and I always was interested in engineering and design and um, it was a logical thing to do to try and do design boats that I wanted to sail first of all and one of the reasons for uh, designing boats myself is that I couldn't ever find any boat that I liked that someone else had designed so I thought well I have to design my own. And I went to college and did it properly. I did a three-year yacht design course yeah. in you, Southampton. You do, you do have a formal education I had a, in yacht In it. yacht design, yes. And it was, uh, I think it's still probably the first, this, still the only full-time uh, college-based course. I suppose a lot of people do correspondence courses and a lot of people do boat building or boat yard management. But I think it's still the only yacht design course. And so you'll see if you go into people's... Uh, biographies that they've a lot of people uh, have done the same course as I did and I left in 1978 so 1975 to 78 so I've been a designer a uh, full-time designer since then and that's been my income I haven't been doing it as a hobby or have another income that's all I've